Recently, a couple college football stars have decided not to play in their bowl games and instead prep for the NFL draft. What's your reaction to the decision that uh, Fournette and McCaffrey have recently made? I mean, at the end of the day, you know, it's their decision. Yeah. You know, it's, 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 it's up to them. You know, I'm pretty sure they had this conversation with their parents and, you know, their agent or whatnot. But it has its ups and downs. You know what I mean? The, the up part, the, the good part about it is that, you know, you won't, you won't be getting hurt. Right. Hopefully you, you, pre, you prevent, you prevent the injury from happening in the game or whatnot. The bad part is you got your teammates looking at you. You know, you got the school, you got your fans, you know, they're going to feel some, they're going to feel some type of way for the rest of their lives about this whole situation. The worst possible case scenario is going out there and getting hurt. And that's exactly what happened to you. So as a guy that went through that, do you understand their decision? Do you, do you feel their decision is a smart one? Oh, I understand the decision very well. You know what I mean? I, and I, and I really, I really get why they're doing it. You know, is it a smart one for them? Yeah. You can't, you can't knock a person from protecting themselves. You know, you gotta look at it like this. Basketball players do it. They don't want to get hurt. They got contract gear. They sit out. You know what I mean? But me personally, I would I would go and play. I would do it all over again. My advice be the decision you make is a decision you got to live with for the rest of your life. You know what I mean? Because think about it. You make the decision not to play. Who says you're going to be great in the NFL? Who says you're g- going to be, you know, that guy, like, you, you, you get what I'm saying. Yeah, so, it's funny. I know, told Jacob Hester yesterday, and he was saying, and I think uh, Ezekiel Elliott tweeted this also. He was saying, I'd give anything to go back and just play one more college game. Everybody always wants to get to that next level and always wants to move on. Uh, maybe you don't realize right. that these are the best times of your life right now. Yeah, you got to understand. Like, I played college ball, and I played for four different teams. Who do you think is the most loyal to you? Miami. Miami. If you like what you just saw and you want to see more videos of your favorite athletes, crazy stories, and just all the best off the field stuff, uh, subscribe to the TMZ Sports YouTube channel. The subscribe button is right here. And check out more of our exclusive content right here.